on the historical tradition of the rabbi and when they came before the rabbi to regurgitate all the rabbi's teaching they would end or start I can't remember which one but it was start or end but they would say I received this of first importance so the atheist scholars such as Richard Carrier uh, debunked on methodology and debunked on data the, da the data is showing us that right early on there was a clear understanding of the death and resurrection of Christ and it did not move into some kind of mythological development as, an, as Richard Carrier would, would say so so what am I trying to say here I think what I'm trying to say is that the skeptics need to take into consideration the data of first century Judaism um, I'm always surprised at Richard Carrier's quotations, the atheist scholar of uh, first century literature. Every time I've checked Richard Carrier's sources, when he's quoted Philo, when he's quoted uh, the Song of Isaiah, and I have checked, and I check his sources, I check his quotations. Every time I check this atheist scholar out, he always misquotes the text. A um, uh, classic example is he quotes Philo and he says that in the Philo text there is a mention of Jesus and within his lecture he will actually put the text of Philo up with the name of Jesus Jesus in it and people reading that think that the text Jesus within is actually in Philo the word Jesus but actually if you read Philo the word Jesus is not in there the way what Richard Carrier does he does an exegetical dance by going to the Old Testament and then pulling it all together and saying look there's a connection here and it's a reference to Jesus and there was a reference to an early Jesus in Philo ho 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 um, you know this is mythological stuff the early church took these ideas and they developed them but when he quotes his text and he puts he puts the what Philo says he puts the word Jesus in but it's not actually in the text so there's a gross mis misrepresentation to the public about Philo and it's not as clear as Richard Carrier would present and this is a typical example of the shoddy scholarship within uh, the skeptical community concerning the, concerning the scholarship of the resurrection of Christ the misquotation of text, the, mis the mis 